So the next stage we're going to look at is loading in material for the first time. What that's going to be is we're going to unbox the material, we're going to slide it onto the spool holder, feed it into the feeder and let the machine take over so we can push that from the feeder to the nozzle and get that to extrude. The nice thing is the machine is going to walk us through this step by step, so let's make sure that we follow all the right sequence of events and get the material extruding as we'd expect. So the first step we're going to need to do is unpackage the material. Okay, so when it's brand new, we've got plastics around. The material that we get in the box that we're going to be using more often than not is PLA. Now PLA is a nice, easy to print with material. It's made from sugarcane and cornstarch, so there's no harmful nasties in there. And it's the easiest material we can print with on this technology. So from the spool here, we need to locate this onto the back of the machine. But before we do, what we need to do is get rid of this little bend here. We're going to cut the material on a 45 degree angle and just straighten it out ever so slightly. So what we're going to do here is we're going to cut the material so we can load this into the machine. So always keep hold of this end so it doesn't unravel. We're going to cut that there on a 45 degree angle. And what that will then do is mean we can get rid of this excess material here. And then as we hold it like so, we can load that onto the back of the machine. So what we're going to do is we're going to load the material onto the back of the machine. So we're going to push that onto there and you'll see it snap into position like so. The area in which we load this on is so that it comes straight off the spool and then it goes straight into the feeder here. Okay, as you can see, there's a little bit of a bend there. So we're just gonna do a little bit of a straighten out just to help that channel through initially. What we've got here is the material cut on a 45 degree angle and we've got it ever so slightly straightened out here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna lift the lever here. What that's then gonna do is release the pressure inside the feeder. The silver ring that's underneath, we're gonna locate that, push the material through. We might have to do a little bit of a wiggle just to get that located. And you can see it popping up the top here. So what we're gonna do is just push that all of the way through to the top of the machine until we feel it stop. And then we're gonna get that preheated, ready for us to load the material through. From the screen, what we're gonna do is go to material at the top of the screen here. We're then gonna go into load material and we're gonna start loading the material. What it's now saying to us is that we're loading PLA. If we're working with a different material, then we can select no set type and that will allow us to load in different materials. But in this case, because we're working with PLA, we're gonna go yes, that's okay. That's now heating up the nozzle to the desired temperature so we can get that to extrude as desired. Once the machine's at temperature, it's then gonna ask us to put the material through. So because we've already got that loaded in, we're then gonna press material loaded and now the machine's gonna to start to manually extrude the material. Once we've got that coming through, we want to get a nice amount of material pass, pass out. Once we're happy with that, we'll hit material is extruding, and then we're good to start printing. Material is now extruding, we're happy with that. And now it's just going to cool everything down for us so we can actually start loading up and printing. 